Hey, what is going on guys? I am the Explosive Gamer and welcome to the second episode of my Rise of the Dark Spark Let's Play. So we are moving on to the second chapter in the ruins of Crystal City called the Lost Vault. I am, we are playing a sound wave, so let's go. I will overwrite whatever, I don't care. There's nothing there to overwrite because I didn't do anything. Okay, there should be a cutscene here that seems very important, but I don't know. I don't know. So, in the first episode, um, we played as Drift, and we went through the city, and we found the Dark Spark, and then Lockdown took it, and he was like, rah, and then this explains it. Primus himself grants the bearer the wisdom of the Primes. But for every force in the universe, there is an equal and an opposite. For every matter, an anti-matter. Legends speak of the Dark Spark, the antithesis to the Matrix of Leadership. Where the Matrix grants wisdom, the Dark Spark empowers its master to bend the very fabric of the universe and its inhabitants to his will. This is our darkest hour. Cybertron has nearly fallen, and the Autobots are on the verge of defeat. This is our finest hour. Cybertron is nearly ours, and victory is finally within the Decepticons' grasp. Man, I love the music in this. Dun 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 This dark spark even exists. I do not believe Starscream. I hypothesize. My conclusion is not yet formed, but all data leads us here. Ah, yes. Ever the scientist. As you once were. I was a human element. Did you do it? For once we agree, Soundwave. Okay, so here we are. We are in Crystal City. Where the ruins of. Insecticons, holy shit. You dumb bastards. What the hell? That's a face of a robot right there. A big ass robot, but still a face of a robot. Oh shit. Okay. Oh, they're down there, okay. Was there a proper way to get down that, or was that it? I die. They're probably back there like, should we go help them? Nah, it's funny watching. Because they're bastards and Decepticons. Okay, let's go into Crystal City. that and 
slingshot. Actually, yeah. Uh, in my hack. More health, more ammo. I have more of that, so I'm gonna do this. What were those filthy things? Primitive cyber forms. There really that many. Lord Megatron, we have gained access to the facility. What's so important about this thing that we have to trace through acid and ruins? Do you have a desire to cease functioning, Starscream? Yeah. I was just asking. Your is <laughs> matched only by your incompetence. Now cut the static and bring me the dark spark. Affirmative, Lord Megatron. And Starscream, do not question me again. Yeah, Starscream, gosh. Is there any secrets? What a freak, what a freak. It has the same mechanics from War for Cybertron. I imagine so. Continue the search. I will rejoin you after resolving our infestation problem. All right. Just hurry it up. Am I playing a shockwave now? Why can't I transform? Dude! Oh, the hell! Oh, what do we have here? Is it something to eat, eat, eat? Fascinating. The sentient ones share CNA with the feral insectoid protoforms. Hey! What do you call us? I don't know. Let's scrap him! Let me! Oh no. Chester scrambled by EMP. No matter. Thank <laughs> you. 
course I'll get by you. Yeah, shifty motherfucker, come here. Wuss. Funny it says rockets cowards weapon. Well, he's using them, so Okay. Yes. I remember. This is where this is where Shockwave's lab is in Transformers: Fall of Cybertron. This this takes place between Fall uh, War and Fall of Cybertron. So. Sharp shell, come here. He experiments on them or whatever. What exactly are we supposed to do now? This may have been good against uh, uh, the other would say the fun way in hard shell this this gun was not the best. So I wonder if this tells you how what happened to the Dinobots, like uh Grimlock and whatever. On Cybertron. this subsonic repeater I don't want to fight them star screen can do it never mind I'll do it can we go already I want to go and I'm being a little bit quiet I've noticed that so when I was concentrating on fighting them, I was not talking. So now I'm talking more, hopefully. Anyway, hmm, Soundwave. Soundwave, I, I, what I gotta say about Soundwave. Soundwave is like everybody's most favorite character from G1. And in this game, he's just as fun. That rhymed. Not supposed to rhyme, but still it rhymed. Best thing to fight these guys is the um, is the EOTech bolt. So if you're ever on this mission, choose the EOTech bolt. 
Oh no, parkour. What exactly are we supposed to do now? I guess rumbles. Lock entrance to vault. Find controls. Drain acid. Reveal entrance. Rumble eject. Operation. Acid depletion. Depletion. Initiating final drain procedure. Star screen. Prepare yourself. Or am I playing Star Screen now? No? We can sprint and reload in this game. Retrieve him or whatever. I'm gonna just go in a circle. Rumble eject. Operation. Acid depletion. Okay. Got this. Target is this way. Ooh, that's a tech bolt. See, they even recommend it in the, the level. That's awesome. Okay, am I missing one? Yeah, I just missed it. Rumble eject. Operation. Acid depletion. Okay, let's go. I wanna, I wanna get going here. And we're already at 17 minutes. That's longer than the haul of the last one. And I don't think we're halfway done. So, so let's -a go. I don't know how long I can record without problems. Because I just installed a uh, Elgato on this computer. So, because I just got my second monitor. The hell is that? Okay. Anyone else? Anyone else? Okay, there's you. Come on, Rumble, let's do this. Up there. Okay. Oh, there's a ramp right there. Naturally. Rumble eject. Operation. Acid depletion. Lucky frickin'. Stars gonna be up there, away from most of them. Okay, we got them all. They're Decepticons. Yeah, welcome aboard. Welcome aboard. <laughs> Very good. In 
Insecticons, leave us onward into the vault. Awesome. That's cool, that's cool. Onward into the vault. Yes, by all means. Let us continue this pointless fool's errand. Honestly, Starscream. They are. Fascinating creatures. It is pure conjecture, but. I just want to know if that's the end of our bug problem. Not entirely. Those three influence the swarm, but as is the case with such primitive societies, they do so only through asserting dominance. When they are present, the others defer to them. But when they are absent, they'll still be feral bugs. Great. Cease your whining, Starscream. Now let me focus on opening this door. Let's go. Ooh. Well, that was fast. More doors! Yay, exciting. Let's go shockwave! Woo! You can do it, buddy, I believe in you. What is it now? Something appeared on my scanners just before the door closed. Soundwave? Scanning. No signatures detected. Satisfied, Starscream. Or perhaps the Insecticons have unnerved you. I'm not afraid. I'm telling you, there was something back. Door is masking the signature. It appears as if someone was here before us, eons ago, based on a very preliminary assessment. Inactive defense systems. Caution warranted. Yes, quite. I can start. Not stand right in front of the door, you ass. So shockwave, uh, there you go. Thanks, man. Okay, next one. You coming? Guys? Yeah, they are. That was weird. Okay. Mm, oh my god. I took a little bit of ammo there. There you go, smart one. Turrets deactivated. They should no longer be a hindrance. <laughs> As they like all pop down from the ceiling and start killing us. That's a relief. Look at them all. A significant amount of firepower. We are getting close. Not yet. Almost. We encountered unexpected resistance in the form of. I detect excuses, Shockwave. No, Lord Megatron. We are just outside the vault. We will have it soon. I'm gonna keep the tech vault. Once you have it, set course for Calcula and deliver it to me personally. As you command. Lord Megatron. Okay, let's go. Oh shit. Shockwave. Yes, I see it too this time. Zeta Prime. How curious. Protect the artifact. Annihilate the intruders. Oh no, the Zeta Prime clones. Remnants of Cybertron's golden era. What a fascinating history lesson. Now shut up and blast them. Yo, bastard, where are you shooting me from? Oh, 
Oh shit. They look exactly like Zeta Prime. Do they run out of uh, looks? Or something? And you know, if you don't know who Zeta Prime is, he is in the in the Cybertron series of games. He was the predecessor to um, Optimus Prime. So, so yeah. And then he died, and then Megatron killed him. So. Is that it? No. Okay, let's go already. Laser beak. Come on. I'm already down here. I'm already down here and I can't get back up. Oh, wait, can I? Oh yeah, there's a ramp over here. Oh, there's stairs over here. Steal yourself, Starscream. Clarity of thought before rashness of action. Crystal guardians protect only the most valuable assets. Their presence is good news indeed. Ancient zealots trying to scrap us is your idea of good news? <laughs> you can be quite short sighted, Starscream. You see peril where I see proof. The dark spark is here. Trace the conduits. Four terminals control access. Simultaneous upload of keys is required. A pity, then, that we are only three. Laser beak, eject. My mistake. Three and a half. Spread out and find the other three access terminals. Then await my signal. I shall secure the fourth. Okay. Because you already know what that is, you dumb fuck. Megatron will be most pleased. Don't worry, I have to get two. Oh, it's just two. Three, four. not the only one encountering difficulties, Starscream. I'm the only one whose problems are of any significance! Why? Why him? Why is he more important? Itchy neck. No, you bastard. Come here. Shit! I didn't want to die there. Come on. Maybe I'll split this into two parts. I guess I'll have to, actually, because of how long it is. Or, oh, no, I'll just upload it. I'll just upload each, ep each episode as each episode. 
Actually, no, I'll, I'll do that one last. Do I want to do that one last? Nah, let's do it. are not the only one encountering difficulties, Starscream. Not the only one whose problems are of any significance. Why are his of significance? I always I wonder that now. Difficulties on easy, which is as easy as it gets. There's no like even easier than that. Ah, there. Okay, I cut up. I cut, cut up my foot in the paper towel that I taped around. It isn't really uh, sticking on there. I think I think I have the the, the pattern the I want to go one down. I just, I just don't have the to kill everybody down. Are them battle sentries, man? They are. That'll be the death of me again. Get out. Oh, oh, that might have hurt. Let me demo.
down. I am nearly at the upload point. Well, isn't that wonderful for you? Starscream, are you? Yes, yes, I'm here. Let's get this over with already. Oh, way up there, okay. Okay, are we done? Are we done? Is that the end? That was 40 minute episode right there. 40 minutes, man. Holy crap. Oh, I hope that's not the longest one. I hope that is the longest one we have to do anyway. Because, <laughs> man, that was a long ass mission. Iron hide and side swipe. <laughs> See Ironhide? I told you this would work. They had no idea we were tailing them. Well, I don't like it. Nothing ever this easy, sideswipe. Here we are. The vault is open. <laughs> Auto ones. They have the dark spark. Quickly, stop them. Why don't they transform, man? They can turn into cars and shit. This is chapter three, okay. Anyway, guys, hope you all enjoyed that episode, and I'll see you all in the next.